what poppin' Scorpios. This is going to be your monthly um, tarot, baddie tarot scope, excuse me, for August 2019. So if you guys are Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus, Scorpios, this reading is for you. Keep in mind this reading is general, it's not a personal reading, so it may or may not pertain to you. This is gender open, not for just one gender, it's for everybody. So take what resonates with you. Let's go ahead and get into your reading this month. I will be using my Batty Oracle cards, my Walu Tarot, my, um, well not my card, but the Fashion Oracles and the Fenty and Savage Playing cards, okay? So let's go ahead and get into this reading, starting with the Self Love Self Care, the Star and the Queen of Swords. So the Queen of Swords and the Star as healing, okay? So this could be balancing out your imaginative energies, focusing more on um, maybe practical and logical things, or maybe rationalizing your ideas or putting them more to the ground, if that makes sense. So grabbing hold of your, um, my dog, sorry about that. Grabbing hold of your creative energies and bringing them down to the physical and, you know, putting them in a place of practicality, if that makes sense. I'm sorry about my dog. Sorry about that. I can't even um pause this because it's recording. So. <sighs> Say hi Nova. Hi Novi. Um so yeah, so what I'm getting with this is that more so this is a focus on your dreams and your goals, but putting them and bringing them down to earth and actually making something out of them or, you know, using your rational mind, your intellect to gather these things, not getting too caught up in the, you know, the imagination world to where you can't, you don't, you know, bring it down into the physical and actually do something with it. Um, your reading is getting all types of um interruptions i'm sorry so um with your playing cards you have the five of spades and the eight of hearts so some of you guys may be feeling a little bit of lack in Im an imagination or feeling like hopeless when it comes to grabbing a, or obtaining a goal something specifically that you feel is out of your reach but it, like i said it's all about bringing it down to the physical and actually um you know making it something that's tangible it's not that it's out of reach but it's like you actually have to do something with you have to mold it if that makes sense i hope i'm making sense um with the mood the rihanna mood you have is the jack of clubs which is cheers or a rock star so i get this vibe that some of you guys could use a little more playful energy a little more lightheartedness maybe go out do something that you enjoy just stop giving a fuck for right now, if that makes sense, um, or certain things. And that doesn't mean that you don't care. That doesn't mean that you don't care. It just means that um, you just don't care as much and you're not allowing it to take hold of your energy and control you, okay? If that makes sense. Nope. So let's see what your fashion tips are. You have haters and deals. So... Fashion tip is that give people something to talk about. You know what I mean? And this could also be thrifting with sales or you might find some sort of um, sales that other people are like, where'd you find that? Like, how did you get that? Or, you know, certain things like that. Thrifting is like, you can't go wrong with thrifting. I haven't found some dope stuff on sales racks that other people might not even look at. And then when you put it on, everybody else is like, where'd you get that? That's the vibe I get from these cards. Or, oh, Where'd you buy that from? Like, girl, I got this at the Goodwill, or I got this off a three dollar um, rack, and nobody looked over there. But you know, you found something and you made it work. This is the vibe I get for you guys, Scorpios, as far as your fashion tips. If you guys have haters, give them something still to talk about. That's what I'm saying. Don't be the hater. That's another thing. Don't hate on somebody else. But I feel this is more so you. And um, if you guys are a like. A person that you know even at forever 21 and stuff like they have like a sales section or like a discount section you can find some really cute shoes in there you find some nice dresses and stuff jackets and stuff even um i feel like people would hate on it like where did you get that piece from like no this ain't on fashion nova this is 
you know, you can't find this on Amazon. This is something that I just, you know, went around the way and picked up. So yeah. Um, so your fashion oracle card is Philip Tracy. Tracy, I hope I'm pronouncing his name right. A hat is a statement, not a shelter. Dress from toe to trilby. Um, millinery is, isn't is invite only. Invite only. I hope I'm pronouncing this right. These words right. So that is your fashion oracle. I apologize for the disruption, y'all. My dog, I don't know. Got a lot to say. But much love as always. If you guys like this video, feel free to like it, share, subscribe. Also, um, if you guys would like to purchase any of my personal decks, the Batty Oracle and the Wally Tarot, or any other of my decks, you guys can check the description box. Book me for a reading. Check the description box below. And as always, I appreciate you. Until the next reading, peace.